just looks so homey. I like to carry around a dry piece of 2 by 4 with me. It makes starting a fire so much easier. So we're supposed to get a snowstorm tonight. It's kind of hard to believe because it's so warm out right now. It's been warm out all day. It's been 60 degrees. It's early March right now. And uh, it's been unseasonably warm the past couple days. It's supposed to rain at first and then eventually it's going to turn into snow overnight. At least that's what they're calling for. We'll see. So I'm looking forward to it. And right now, the wind is blowing that way. It's, it's shifting a little bit up on this mountain. I didn't want to put the opening of my shelter facing the direction where the snow is going to be coming in. Because uh, that wouldn't be good. For obvious reasons. So, hopefully, the wind doesn't shift. Hopefully, it doesn't start, you know, blowing right into the tent or right into the tent from the other direction. If so, I'll adjust the tent. So here's my setup inside here. And this is a cheap vinyl rain poncho that I laid down on everything. Just to help with the moisture. 
in case it starts raining pretty good. I don't want it soaking into my sleeping bag. And I have my wool sleeping bag. It's my Paps. It's really old. And my sleeping pad under here. It's also really old. And then I'm going to put my sleeping bag on top of everything. And that's what we're going to use tonight. You're going to be a lot warmer if you insulate yourself from the ground. It's been a long day. And... I need a nap. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to take a nap. It's already starting to get pretty cold out. I mean, as soon as that sun went down, it started getting kind of breezy. And it's getting chilly. It's getting chilly already. Might be in for a cold night. Luckily, I've got all my warm gear with me. I'm going to crawl into my sleeping bag. Take a nap. Good night. Bring on the snow. I'm ready. Oh yeah. It's uh it's uh really coming down. Yeah, the snow has begun. Fire's out. Just woke up from sleeping a little bit ago. And it is blowing and snowing out here like crazy. All right, so the wind is blowing right into my shelter from the from the rear, as you can see. Once this uh, snow started coming in, the wind shifted. So we got to close that up because getting covered in snow in there. We can't have that. So I'm gonna I'm just gonna close this up. There. Looks better now. It's getting all through there. All right, so uh, let's hunker down. It's getting, it's getting pretty serious out here. Wow. I have, a, I have another tarp. I think I'm gonna put right here, especially for when I get this fire going. I'm gonna need more tarp. So I'm gonna I'm gonna work on that now. Whew! Okay. So we got this shelter all cinched up pretty good, pretty tight. I added a second tarp. And I have the back of the tent cinched up pretty good too. Keep that snow from blowing in here. I wasn't sure exactly where the storm was gonna be coming from. I misjudged it a little bit, but we're all right. We're good. We fixed it. It's all you can do. But I'll tell you what, it is really coming down out there. I'm way on top of the mountain right now. And when it snows here, it snows. It doesn't mess around. I am like 300 yards from the summit of the mountain. So I'm, I'm pretty high up there. We were supposed to get rain first, and then it was going to slowly turn into snow. But, but yeah... It, it skipped that rain and went straight to snow. Yeah, we're looking good though. It's, it's actually not bad in here. It's actually kind of warm. I'm warm. Help that I've, I've been moving around a lot too. That sure helps. I don't think it's stopping anytime soon either. Uh, I'm nice and toasty in this sleeping bag. I'll tell you that much. I'm, I'm going to try and get some more sleep. That's what I'm going to do. So, good night. I'll see you in the morning. I keep having to hit the sides of the tarps. Knock that snow off the sides so it doesn't cave in on me. It is really piling up out there. So it's morning. It just got light out. And it is windy out there. And it sounds like it's still snowing. I'm going to take a look outside.
got my sides piled up with snow here. It is a winter wonderland in March, ladies and gentlemen. I'm going to get up and go assess the situation. Let's see what's going on out there. Oh yeah, we got a good bit of snow. It's definitely still coming down. Here's where I had to cinch it closed last night. Worked pretty well. It's not the prettiest thing in the world, but it did the trick. And then I put a second tarp up. That's not pretty either, but it did the trick. So I'm gonna fix that and then uh, get a fire going. Cook some food, because I'm getting hungry. a good bit of snow.
getting pretty chilly out. But this fire is keeping me nice and warm. Pretty excited about this cheesy bannock bread. I'm gonna make some coffee too. The wind's starting to pick up again. Still snowing. I don't care. I love it. And I really get warmed up when I go start cutting wood and splitting it and gathering it. You know what they say. When you cut wood, it warms you twice. I haven't even had to put my jacket on. I don't like to put my winter jacket on when I'm running around chopping wood and cutting wood and stuff because I start to get all sweaty and that's no good. The one nice thing about that wind is it really stokes up the fire. Check the bannock. It's looking good. That'll settle them to the bottom. At least that's what we're hoping for. My morning coffee. That's good stuff. Cowboy coffee. I highly recommend it. Especially after a long, cold night camping out, uh, this really hits the spot. Very simple recipe, but that's all it takes. Uh, it's so good. You know, it's like my pap always said. A cracker tastes like steak when you're in the woods. Well, thanks for joining me on my little camping trip. Hope you enjoyed the video. I think I'm gonna start packing up and get out of here. I'm gonna hike back, back to my truck and hopefully these mountain roads aren't too bad.
which they're probably going to be. Anyway, if you like my video, give it a like. Subscribe for more.